Hello everyone, I am IA Roadkill and this is Roadkill Science. Today we are going to do a grass study. We are going to investigate grass through different stages. Kneading plowed needing limed and has no fertilization up to plowed, limed, and fertilized. And we will compare all of the results. I will have the game saved so that we can always back up and do the exact same patch again. But to help us, because after I plow and lime, the tractors might be moved. I have added the little concrete or blacktop patches in front of the tractors so that they are pretty close to where they should be at the start. Without further ado, let's see what we get for bad grass. It needs everything. All right. End of round one, pass one, and it's unanimous. We have 15,476 liters of grass in each of our loading wagons. For pass number two, we want to have the ground plowed, but not limed and no fertilization. So here we are using the Cultiplow to turn the grass under that we have right now, giving us a plowed state. And we are going to come up along behind that with two planters and planting fresh grass. And then we will let that grow and we will move on after it grows for our next test. So here we are the next day. The field is showing plowed but needs lime and no fertilization. And here you can see it on the map. Plowed but not limed and no fertilization. It is also in the orange state, which is the state I will be using 
when we mow each time. It gives the highest yield. And here we are, end of pass number two. And once again, it is unanimous. And this one surprised me. 15,476 on all loading wagons. Plowing the field does absolutely nothing for grass yield. For pass number three, we need to lime. And to do that, we need a field that is in a lower state than ready to harvest. So I decided I would mow the entire field. But then I noticed that just the act of mowing was giving it a stage one of fertilization. Oh, so now I have to start over. So we plowed. And we limed. And we planted again. Till we got a state of growing grass with no fertilization. Then we sit back and wait and let the grass grow and mature. We are finally ready for pass number three. The field has been plowed, limed, but no fertilization. Here you can see it on the map. It is golden growth state. and no fertilization.
Oh my goodness. It's unanimous again. 15476. There is absolutely no difference between liming, plowing on a grass field. That surprised me. So here we are preparing for pass number four. We are mowing the entire field, which will give it the first stage of fertilization. And then we wait for it to grow again. Showtime! We are ready for pass number four. The field has 50% fertilization. It is in golden growth state. And you can see it's 50% fertilized. End of pass number four, and the results are unanimous again. I never would have thought they would be unanimous every time. 18,341, almost 3,000 more. First stage of fertilization does improve yield. Finally, we are now preparing for pass number five. We have mowed the entire field and are now applying the second layer of fertilization. And now all we have to do is sit back and wait for it to grow. And it is morning and it is time for the final pass. We have the field in a fully fertilized state. And it is golden growth stage. And there you can see it's fully fertilized.
And the final pass results again are in with a unanimous vote. 21, 209. It has increased again. This time it increased by 2,868. One fertilization increased it. 2,865, almost identical for each fertilization. So there you have it. This was going to be the end of the video, but I realized while editing and re-watching that I posed a new question. Somebody's going to ask, well, what's the yield between the two states of growing? when it's yellow to the dark orange. So here we are. It is in the yellow state of growth, and you can see that it is also fully fertilized. And once again, it is unanimous. 14, 135 liters in each of the loading wagons. I hope you forgive me for running that through at a high time lapse. So there is your proof that it is better to wait for the golden state of growth. I'd like to thank everyone who stayed to watch the entire video. I hope that you found it enjoyable, educational, and entertaining. I would appreciate it if you would hit the like and the subscribe buttons. And if you would like to leave a comment, you may do so below. With that said, I'd like to wish everyone, including you, a very wonderful day. Goodbye for now.